Hey guys, it's Bob the Dude here, and today I've just got this package newly in from uh, the uh, the package place. You know, and we're going to do a little unboxing, see what this magical box is. Let's screw up some scissors. So we're gonna have a little pocket knife on us real quick. Let me go like so. Bubble wrap is always a good sign. Uh huh. Look, there it is. Asia 64 Simmons. Alright. Let's go ahead and let's, let's take a look at it. The box is a bit damaged, but I think that'll be good. Let's take her out of the box. Alright, guys. You can see we've gotten out of the box here. Let's see what we got. We have the quick start guide, always good. All the functions, stuff set up to the side. We have Bachman parts thing. Whatever. Just in case, you know, spare parts. No, okay. We have. An exploded parts diagram, Bachman warranty, and of course the engine. All right, let's, uh, this, let's this um, yes. Yeah, so we have the engine. We have our uh, clamshell packaging. There's an old screw locomotive out. Let's get up right close and personal to this ACX 60. Now here we are up close and personal to the this Bachman ACS 64. Let's check out the detail. We have uh, MU hoses on both sides, MU ports, uh, Easy Mate 2 coupler. I know that means the actual spring. Coupler cup lever. Um, some more uh, uh, brake hose, windshield wipers, grab irons, headlight, marker light, uh, we have the headlight, we have the uh, number boards that do light up, up top here, we have air conditioning unit, some molded on uh, detail here. Uh, Panograph, some more electrical detail, dual horns, another panograph on the opposite side, opposite end. let's take a look at the side here, we have the American flag, the F for front, ACS 64, and of the number, we have a, a port here, Simmons, grab irons, door, window, and then we have the Amtrak logo, Nice striping. Oh, the paint is very, very, very clean on this one. Another AC64 flag again, and track in the letter. It's all legible. Let's make it seem on the side. Let's, let's take a little look over here. Let's flip it over. Underway. Yeah. We have the trucks here. Some nice and on detail. The wheels. Nice. Some detail over here. We have the uh, generator, battery box, something. Look here, if someone did have a, have a pantograph, you can flip that switch and it would go to the pantograph. Okay, let's, okay, let's weigh this locomotive. Let's see how heavy it is. Um, hopefully it's heavier than most things. So let's throw on our little scale. Let's put this PC 64 on here. All right, one pound, uh, nine ounces. All right, that's not bad. That is, you know, typical weight for a locomotive. So, let's get this locomotive 
on the tracks. Right, Y'all, we're at the layout. Let's put this locomotive on the tracks. We have it today. We we have it paired up with some uh, not prototypical, uh, just some um, coaches from Walters and track coaches. And uh, yeah, she's a life. And today I'm going to be using my um, my uh, Digitrax UT4 throttle. And we're gonna see these. This has audio assist, which is very interesting. Little button. It's very nice. TCS well sound. Good sound. Okay. We now have our. Digitrax throttle and oh, quick start guide in hand just in case you know you need to know what's going on. And I have already set the locomotive's address to 619, which is the number on the side of the cab. And we will uh, see what's going on. So let's open her up to the functions. Let's see. Number one, zero's headlight, which is on. Number one is is bell, and it's and flash this light. Very nice bell, I'd say. All right, let's do F function two, which is horn and dish lights. All right. Let's do uh, function four, which is whoosh. Let's see what that is, huh? Hmm. Takes a long time. Now, F6, which is start, shut down. Hmm. Interesting. And while we're at it, let's go ahead and look at the working pantographs. Uh, very nice sprung, sprung action. Nice. I'm gonna leave this back one up here. Right. Okay. Now we have. We're gonna power back on by hitting F6 again. Very nice, very nice. All right, uh, now we have F3, which is short horn. Now we have F7, which is dim headlight. Okay. Now let's go into audio assist, which is very interesting. It's where you press F8, eight times, four times. So you, you're gonna press shift here. Welcome to audio assist. Mm. Use button one to hear the sound programming options. Use interesting. Two very nice. And I, before options. this, um, Use button three to I was hear looking through the, the manual and stuff for a recording. Options. And, uh, well, I forgot out of the box and stuff, because that was my live reaction. But I, if you press 4, then press 5. Oh. Let's press F1 for Star Spangled Banner. Let's play the song. I'm guessing this is for the uh, livery with the uh, veterans PC. You can operate your throttle still.
and best zero to a, as always, if you like so. And we will hook her up to some cars and do a quick little running session on the layout. And I will be reviewing some uh, Bachman um, cars later. I mean, two days time, so uh, yeah. Let's get to this session.
Hey, thank you for watching Bob the Dude and his ACS 64's little video I just made. And uh, go hit that like button. Go subscribe. It really helps me out. Kinda. Yeah, but do it if you want. Don't do it. I really don't care. I'd appreciate it if you did, but you know. Well, that's the, let's wrap up the end. That's the end of this video. Thank you for watching. This is Bob the Dude. Son, no.